Welcome back. In this video, I'm going to teach you how you can create a manual product to sell from your launch cart store really fast. All you need to do, log into your launch cart admin panel, go to products, create new. When you do this, you'll see three different options. And for this video, we're going to be using the very first option to create a manual product. So press create new here, and this will take you into our manual product creation wizard. Now, a manual product means that you need to fill out everything about that product, including the descriptions, you need to have images, you need, you need to have prices, shipping costs, and so on. Now, I will say this, if you're looking to sell print-on-demand products, we have a very nice option. Uh, we have hundreds of products available. Uh, you should use our print-on-demand product wizard, and you can do that by clicking on the second or third options here, and we'll have videos on that as well. Um, but this is for people who want to sell manual products. Maybe you're an artist and you have products that you physically make at home, or maybe you have inventory in a warehouse that you want to sell, uh, and these are your products that you'll be doing all the shipping and the processing yourself. Or maybe you're using a third-party fulfillment company. Um, either way, this is how you would do it. You'd come here and you'd give it a name. You could change your product URL. This is actually the URL of where this page uh, would be located on your store. You would enter in a description. You would add images, you would add your pricing, you would add your shipping, and you would add variants. Now, let me walk you through variants really fast. A lot of people get confused on how variants work, so I'm going to make this very fast and very easy to understand. Let's say you're selling hats, and your base hat is $25, um, but the hat comes in different sizes and color options. So we would click on the Add Variants button, and we would add a color option. And maybe your hats come in, uh, I'm sorry, they come in white and they come in black. You would add that there. And then maybe they come in different sizes. So we'll click on add another option. And this time we're going to put in the word size. And then we're going to put in your size options. So maybe, maybe they come in small and large. There we go. Now if we scroll down, we'll see what just happened. It just created all these different variant options down below. I can customize each variant with a custom image. I get to see which variant that I'm working with. This particular um, row is a white small hat. I can input a different SKU and I can change the price. Maybe it's a small, maybe it costs less. And then you go to the white large and so on and so on. If you leave these blank, this will inherit your default price that you set above or you can set individual prices for every single variant. So it customizes how you want, then you get taken down to the bottom. If you have uh, categories already created, you can check off those here, and this will assign this product to a particular category in your store. If you don't have any categories, you can create those right up here. And then you can uh, add a product type. This is optional, but let's say maybe you want to add hat as your product type, and you can add tags. These are used by the software in other places. Uh, they are optional, but you can add them if you want, and then you can simply hit save, and this product is ready to go. And that's how easy it is to create a manual product. Now, if you don't want to create manual products, and maybe you prefer to sell print-on-demand products where all the shipping and handling and packaging is taken care of, then go ahead and check out our other video about how to create your first print-on-demand product using Printful. That's the one you'll want to see. Other than that, thanks for watching, and stay tuned for more.